And the impact of the Syrian airstrike also being felt right here in Kern County. 23 ABC's Ken Masenchi spoke with a Muslim leader who says the turmoil is part of a bigger issue, right, Ken? Yeah, Tim, one local man, as you were mentioning, says Syria is the one that's grabbing the spotlight, but this issue spans to several other countries as well and says there really isn't going to be a change unless there is a change at the top. The reality it, it is we have deeper and bigger problems and that our leaders failed us. That's just the bottom line. It's pretty cut and dry to Ali Zachary. Change the leaders in countries like Syria. Absolute power corrupts absolutely. Zachary, who serves as the president of the Islamic Shura Council of Bakersfield, says there is absolutely no reason why the situation in Syria amounted to the violence seen this week. People have to understand that the Muslim world is in such a turmoil and we have bad people leading out the charge over there. They all need to go. They all need to go. They, because nobody is, is willing to take care, is willing to take care of our own people there. Zachary says Syria has the spotlight, but neighboring Muslim countries are in the same dire situation, with many people in the U.S. wanting to go back home to help, but are scared for their safety. Because you don't know whether you're going to wake up the second day or you're going to get shot at at any time. Zachary says at any time, other Muslim countries could have stepped in to help their brothers and prevent the U.S. from having to step in with the airstrike. It is shocking. It's amazing. It's appalling that none of our uh, Muslim countries, especially in the Gulf, they're so rich, none of them is opening the door to them. Opening the door to a world where violence in Syria don't grab the spotlight, where the U.S. doesn't have to play referee. This is an ongoing discussion, not because of this. It's been ongoing for years and years and years. Zachary added that groups in Kern County have raised money and sent care packages to people in countries like Syria. But he says until that leadership changes, he believes this cycle of violence will sadly continue. Live in downtown Bakersfield, Ken Masenchi, 23 ABC.